Today I will begin the greatest adventure Flakegear has to offer. I am going to circumnavigate the world without the aid of GPS. The route follows the basic rules for setting speed records in circumnavigation through aviation, which can be found on Wikipedia as well as other sites dedicated to circumnavigation. Those rules? The course of a round-the-world record must start and finish at the same point and cross all meridians. The course must be at least 36,787.559 kilometers long, which is the length of the Tropic of Cancer. That's about 19,863 nautical miles long. The course must include set control points at latitudes outside the Arctic and the Antarctic circles. I'm going to add another rule. If Flakeer crashes, I will make one attempt to redo the current leg. After that, I move on whether it's completed or not. This way, I can commit to the entire flight and not let one crash just stop me and bog up my time so that if others fly with this rule they can compete or something if they choose um, yeah and here is the basic route well watered down route I will be following basically um, visiting uh, some of the greatest airports in flight gear Yeah, so let's get started. Alright, we are at Wings Field. Skies are clear, winds are calm. It's great weather for flying. Looking good for getting started on my flight around the world. So let's start this thing up. And take off. Alright, I'll begin my descent into miles. Alright, runway in sight. Now I just gotta land.
sure to take better see which way the runway is going. Okay, looks like I'm roughly lined up with it. Sort of. Gonna have to drop my off. this again. No! I'm going to make it to the airport. Ow! Uh. On the way... Well, I made it to the airport, and that's what it counts, I guess. Now, how do I get down? 